Sarah. I just wanted to kind of show you where we have stuff for right now. Um, currently, on the top of the desk, we have the uh, side down is finished, and this is what's coming up next. Down here, paper to print on, and then scrap paper to use to make plates. So I wanted to show you real quick how to do that. I'm going to take the next page, which is page 27, and I'm going to bring it over, and I'm going to put it on the copier, the Duplo machine, and I'm going to line it up to where both edges are on the uh, letter, the LG, so it should be pretty well lined up right between them. I'm going to carefully close the lid so that it doesn't blow the paper and move it. I'm going to come over, grab a stack of paper, and it's going to go in the side tray. And I just make sure that it's nice and lined up. And get a piece of scrap paper. That way we're not being too wasteful with the plates. And if you already know all this, I'm sorry. Um, to make the plate on this machine, you always hit clear first and then plate making. It will make your plate and spit out a sample to see if you're happy with it on the right side of the machine. And if you're happy with it, um, the recycling is right under the bin. You can come up to the tray, and we've been making 125. That way we have room for error because once in a while these will print and the paper will stick together. So we like to have 10 extra. We figured uh, we had 10 more orders come in to the office, so we put it up to 115 roughly. So after you have your number pressed in, we hit start, and we're off. When it's time to print the next page on the back side of that paper, I'm going to start and do the same thing. Here's page 28. And when I put the paper in the machine, I want to make sure that as it lays in here, that it's the head of the paper to the head of the paper here. So it's head facing the head. I'm not sure that I'll have my phone on or be able to answer any questions, but I hope this helps. Thanks.